Welcome to Polymap Day TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. It is Wednesday, October 28th. I am Shreyal Dhumi. Our special newsreel today is sponsored by Ahmedabad-based Sweet Industries. Let's start with energy news. Crude oil prices marched higher on Tuesday as another major tropical storm Zeta forced the operators in the Gulf of Mexico to shut over 16% of their total crude oil output and are anticipated to further shut down the offshore platforms as the tropical storm makes its way to the north and is expected to cause a landfall on Wednesday. Brent futures gained by 74 cents, settling at 41 US dollars 20 cents per barrel, while WTI futures spiked by 1 US dollar 1 cent, settling at 39 US dollars 57 cents per barrel. According to Vandana Hari of Manda Insights, Crude futures were surrendering gains made at Tuesday's settle early Wednesday in Asia in response to the American Petroleum Institute reporting a sizable build in the U.S. crude and gasoline inventories for the week ended October 26. On Tuesday, open spec NAFTA prices gained by four U.S. dollars per metric ton at the 373 U.S. dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Moving on to the Asian market updates for PP and P. In PP, this week PP prices gained in Asia. The price rise was supported by improved buying sentiments in the region and higher import offers from the overseas suppliers, coupled with stronger PP futures on the Dalian Commodity Exchange in China. Reports of tight product availability further supported the price gain. In LDP, this week LDP prices climbed higher in Asia. Prices firmed as demand trends continue to remain strong in the region. Tight product avails and firmer import offers from the overseas producers further supported the price rise. In HDP, HDP prices witnessed a rise in the Southeast and South Asian regions this week. The price rise was on the back of higher import offers from the overseas producers and a lift in buying sentiments in the region coupled with limited product availability. For detailed price assessments of PP, P and PVC, we invite you to subscribe to Polymer Update. Our weekly benchmark price assessments and analysis are available on our website for all our subscribers to benefit from. Our special newsreel today is sponsored by Ahmedabad-based Sweet Industries. Established in the year 2005, a reputed manufacturer and supplier of thermoplastic injection molding machines. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. It is Wednesday, October 28th. I am Shreyal Dhumi. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash polymerupdate and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at polymerupdate. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.